welcome back to my channel. I hope you're well, good, healthy, happy. <laughs> so I really hope you had a fantastic Halloween and you know what? I think everyone knows that once Halloween is over, even though we're like all sad because Halloween is just so much fun, the day after Halloween people, it's acceptable to talk about Christmas, play Christmas music I think, start getting all decorations out and at the ready to start decorating and make everything about Christmas. I just absolutely love this time of year, it's the best. However, that's kind of hypocritical of me saying because Christmas is cheery and I'm bringing to you an all black autumn winter haul. So that's still kind of Halloween-y, but let's forget that. It's not like a massive haul, it really is just like a few little bits. Um, and if you really enjoy this, I can do like a bigger haul just let me know if it's your kind of vibe you know so I'm really excited about this one guys and I think you know why because I have done a few autumn winter hauls so far on this channel this, for this year um, and I've always tried to stay away from black I've always tried to be a little bit inspo to you that because this time of year it's so easy to kind of like slip into the all black everyone's safe color you feel comfortable in it it's just your you know it's not even color it's a tone everyone's safe tone. <laughs> I've always kind of said in my try on fashion hauls that I really want to get away from the black. I want to mix up a bit, show that you can, you know, look absolutely fab without always falling back to the safe all black outfits. However, I just thought let's just embrace it for this video. So I've picked up a few things and I really want to show you what they are like. This isn't so much a first impressions. These are actually items that I have picked up over the past like few weeks and um, a few things have been sent to me as well which I've absolutely fallen in love with so I want to share it to you. Angels, one more thing before we get into this. I really want to give a wee shout out to Midnight City. They are a jewellery brand and they kindly sent me a whole bunch of their stuff and I'm not kidding, I'm one that literally cannot get enough. Like I love gold jewellery is my fave but they do gold, they do silver and they're such a beautiful brand like their designs and everything it's just so you can tell a lot of love has gone into it and I really want to show you a few of my pieces that I picked. So I'm going to zoom you in to show you um, the pieces that I'm Wearing. Okay, so the pieces on my arm, I've got this beautiful chain gold bracelet and it is so stunning. It fits so good as well. Nice and petite on my wrist because I always um, struggle with that. I always have bracelets that just fall off, but as you can see, this one really stays on. My rings, as you can see, I've got a mix of the gold and silver on and these are so nice because they're just so like minimal and I love the kind of minimalistic look, especially with jewellery. I don't like anything that's too busy. And I've got the large size, as you can see on my middle finger and I've got the medium um, thickness on my index finger and they also do one that's a little bit thinner so they've got the three sizes. This necklace is called the B necklace and you actually get the option of wearing these designs in silver or gold so you can choose. I thought the B because B is like yellow I really wanted to get it in gold and I just think it looks so pretty. These items they're just so delicate on and um, yeah, I just think they make a great addition to whatever outfit you're wearing. And this is the Silver Angel necklace. And you guys know I'm such a spiritual gal, so I love anything to do with angels or anything like that. And I thought it'd be really nice to get this design in the silver. The quality and detailing is so stunning. And again, it's just such a beautiful kind of minimalistic vibe when I'm wearing this jewellery. If you're interested in any of the jewellery items I'm wearing from Midnight City, everything you need to shop is down below in the description box. So before we get into it, I just want to say thank you so so much for clicking on this video. I have no idea how you got here, but please stick around. I really really hope you enjoy this try on haul. Please let me know what you think below um, of like the outfits, the items, what's your fave. If you don't follow me on Instagram, I would love it if you go and follow me. I am on Instagram literally every day. I post every day. It's such a great kind of platform. Obviously I talk to you down below in these um, comments, but it's great to kind of talk to you in direct messages or something in the comments on my Instagram. So yeah, go. I'm sorry, I'm so animated. <laughs> I'm just like this when I'm talking, sorry that's annoying, but um, yeah, and of course hit that subscribe button if you are new here, I would love it if you join the Annie fam, we just love everyone here, and again, we're, we're just growing so quick and it just means absolute world to me, so thank you so, so much, and of course that notification button as well so you don't miss any of my uploads. So, enough to the chatter, let's get into it, I really hope you enjoy, and let's, you know, embrace the all black. <laughs> hey guys, so this is the first look, and this is literally one of my favourite essentials for, I think all time actually like for summer like literally all year you could wear this but I wear this most of the time like in autumn winter just because it's just perfect for layering if you want to have those really nice kind of coats and jumpers and um yeah it's just perfect for layering so this is a rib black 
fitted long sleeve is very important because you can then put like a gilet on top that's sleeveless and you still are covered and this dress as you can see is from Pretty Little Thing. I've got this in a size 4 and it fits me perfectly as you can see it literally is just so figure hugging and it is so stunning with knee high boots so without falling I'm going to attempt to show you um, I got these from Nasty Gal these are kind of like cowboy boots kind of vibe I love the um, thick block heel these kind of outfits are like my go to looks because I feel so comfortable but then it still looks really glam as well. You can put like a nice kind of cape over your shoulders and you look extra glam. You can then jazz it up with a hat and you can literally just play about so many ways. And because it's black, you can add like all neutral colors. Like, you know, you can have a nude hat on and you can play like with berry and all the kind of darker colors like teal this time of year. You can see they've got such cool buckles and um, they these aren't available in Nasty Gal anymore. However, I'm gonna like link a few different ones down below because there are so, so many like of these kind of boots on Nasty Gal. Like, just so much to choose from. I would then add my, I got this from Nasty Girl, but you can literally get these, these are everywhere at the moment, a really nice kind of like shoulder bag, and um, yeah, I think that goes really nicely with this, and then you can add like a jumper, you can add like coats or anything like that. If it was me, I love to wear like a black cape on top of this, um, and just kind of like on my shoulders, and then my hands are like free, and it just kind of gives you that nice structure, you know, that nice kind of structured layer, but um, yeah, so there we go. <gasps> Diamantes on the toe area, oh my god. God, I love these. They are such a good item to have, especially with party season coming up, girls, you know? And I'm raving about this two-piece because you can wear it casually, you can put like trainers on, um, ankle boots I would wear, ankle black boots, you know, kind of like chunky ones to kind of make it, you know? Okay honey, so I'm doing my best to show you the whole outfit, but as you can see, it's this gorgeous midi skirt, and then I've got the heels on as well, there we go, and I just think this is such a lovely look, it's so minimal, um, and also the material of this two piece is so comfortable, again you could add layers on this, you could add like an oversized like jumper, tuck it into the midi skirt, it's really cute, then with ankle boots, but I think this two piece, it doesn't fit me any better, like it is literally so perfect, I'm going to like kind of like rotate so you can see, but as you can see it's so like, oh my god, it just fits so good and at the top area I haven't got a bra on so I'm just gonna go a bit closer as so you can see and yeah it just fits me perfectly and then around the kind of back area as so you can see it goes in on my back it's nice on the bum as well it's nice and flattering it shows its shape off okay so it's time for a nice snug look now I'm so getting into this the kind of oversized sweaters and shirts and things and having really tight cycle shorts I just think it's such a nice look and I'm gonna layer this up with one of the best items I've got so far for autumn winter and it is such an essential it says angel here in red I really like that nice and simple and um but I just love the fit of it I mean because there's so many of these that come and they're so they're like oversized to the max you know and they're just not flattering but I felt really good in this I absolutely love the sleeves I thought the sleeves fit me really good and just the length of this like even though it's not tucked in and the length of this is so good as well um because I'll show you as you can see I just I just love it I think it fits so good the sweater and um it's a really easy one to kind of tuck in as well so if you've got cycling shorts on and you want to kind of like tuck it in like this but um yeah it's just that I just feel like it's such an essential eh? also the good thing about it is that it's soft inside I swear to god there's nothing worse than thinking you're ordering a nice like snug sweatshirt and then it comes and it's not soft inside but this one I mean honestly the deception is real you know and um, but this one, as you can see, it's got really soft fleecing inside. So yeah, I just thought I cannot return this. I had to keep it. Two items, the Nasty Gal. And again, I was pleasantly surprised with them. Nasty Gal kind of sizing is a little bit odd. I mean, they offer size 4. Sometimes I order a size 4 and it fits like a 10, seriously. Um, and these are size 6 cycle shorts. And the only thing that I, the only problem I have with cycle shorts and kind of leggings and jeans and well any kind of bottom is that when it's too tight around the waist or too tight around here because I've got IBS and I do like my comfort but then I want to look glam as well it's difficult balance <laughs> and um but yeah I do kind of bloat out easily and I just want to be comfortable with these it's that nice um that slinky material and with the um cycling shorts they can come up tight like they can and then you worry about camel toe however I'm not getting camel toe in these and because even though they're a four they do feel more like a six eight but they're still tight but they haven't got that really uncomfortable tightness about them so as you can see they still show off like my legs and the shape um and my bum as well but um they're not they're just like and they do fit my waist as you can see they're not like baggy at all but they are like loose if it makes any sense I just can't describe it but yeah I just thought they were like great items to kind of like have a down day in you know don't miss out because these are 
Amazing! I just have to show you. I was so excited. Pretty Little Thing sent this to me and I literally feel, oh my god. It came in a size 2 because it's a petite and um, I got the size 2 and I was like, do I get a size 4 because I want to wear jumpers underneath but I don't want it to come massive. If it comes a little bit tight then I'll just feel snug, you know. But oh my goodness guys, it fits me perfectly. <laughs> I'm going to go back so you can see the um, length of it so yeah it like does up and this is the length of it it goes like at my knee area and I'm just so in love it is so cozy as you can see it's like not oversized I can't describe it sometimes you can get like petite people I know myself that I do worry when getting oversized coats and oversized jumpers because it doesn't it's not flattering on me um, I'm not sure about you like how you feel about it but yeah sometimes when I get big coats like these it just makes me look like so much bigger and it's just not flattering and yeah I just don't like it but with this one it doesn't make me look big at all as you can see um, it goes straight down you've actually got a reasonable good size hood again nothing worse than when you get a coat and the hood on it is so pathetic <laughs> It barely like covers your head, so this is a really good size um hood, and then you can like do it up here. I'll get up a little bit closer so you can see um the material things. So yeah, it really is. Oh my god, this is a must-have people. <gasps> We've had such horrific weather over the past like few weeks, and this has honestly saved me from the wind. Um yeah, I feel like if you live in a place where it's windy, just Scotland basically, um, yeah you really need one of these, they're just perfect for kind of long walks, put a cap on, um, put the hood on over the top and also you've got kind of like space in the coats where you can add like a scarf and yeah it's just, I feel like if you don't get one you're seriously missing out especially to the petite girls out there, you know how it is. Okay honey so this is the next item and this is actually probably one of my favourite things in this haul, I just think it's so me so me, it's so cosy, it's really different um, and I just love cardies, it's actually described as a cardi so basically what we're looking at here, I know this isn't black but it's the best way to show you um, like the detailing and the whole um, a cardi top because I actually just put it over my black cycle shorts but you couldn't properly see so um, yeah this is from Pretty Little Thing, it's so good, I think I got a size 4 and um, what I love about it is that how open it is at the front, it really is kind of done up by the buttons, I haven't got a bra on but if I was to wear it out I would probably put like a bra on and that's me saying that just to like feel a bit more secure but um, I'm going to show you what it looks like at the back because it is so cool and different the length is perfect and then um, yeah at the front I just love how open it is when you're walking it kind of flows in the wind but I want to show you how I'd wear this cardi with accessories and um, how I'd kind of like finish the whole look up so I got sent this amazing black faux fur bucket hat from Elena Grace UK and um, she does all these really cute accessories so what I would do I'm just going to like pop my hair back because fringe like bangs and hats they just don't work together um, so I'm just going to pop this on but it is literally one of my favourite things that I've got for this time of year it is so cosy I love bucket hats and because it's so fluffy I'm not sure if you can see like the uh, material there um, but yeah over this kind of like long cardi I think it's such a cute look and then I put like black boots on and then you can like take the cardi off the shoulder as well honestly I just oh, I feel super cute in this outfit you know like having your shoulders Set. got a cute little kind of flowy cards, you got fluffy hats on, some flared jeans. <laughs> okay, so here we've got a backless number. I love backless bodysuits. They are literally, I feel like they are just so, so cool. I cannot get enough of backless bodysuits and just backless anything at the moment. I just love, I just think backless kind of dresses and things are so flattering. And, um, but yeah, so what you're looking at is, honey, I'm in faux fur trousers. I never thought I'd see the day. Getting trousers to fit, like, petite girls is hard enough but faux fur trousers like I feel like I'm in this trend now because I've been seeing these everywhere and so many girls rocking it and it's so frustrating so I really wanted a pair but these are a pretty little thing and this is from Nasty Girl so I'm gonna turn around and show you the look but I just I mean look how well they're fitting me I mean they fit me around my waist literally perfect there's no adjustables literally it's just like a, um, a zip and because there's a zip it kind of gives you a cute little kind of shape into your butt and um, yeah I'm just loving this bodysuit. I love backless things. Oh my god, I'm gonna get a little bit closer so you can see. And then to show you the length of these trousers, guys, you're gonna freak because I totally did. Look at the length of these trousers. They aren't rolled up, they fit me perfectly and because I like to show a little bit of ankle and that's exactly what they're doing. They're actually cropped on me. Oh my god! And for this whole look, I parted off some cute kitten kind of heeled sandals 
with this. I just think it makes them look very kind of like elegant and I love these. I cannot get enough of these. Everything in this video, there's no leather, like these are faux leather, these are faux leather and um, the shoes are from I Saw First and there will be a link down below as well so you can shop this whole look but I just absolutely love this. I couldn't get over like how well it fits here. It's not too long, like how well it fits around my waist area and then the back as well. I'm just like guys, I'm dying. Like this is literally such a win for me. The other thing is that I feel really comfortable in this and to make it more kind of weather appropriate um yeah you can like add um layers on it or you can put like boots on instead of the um heeled sandals so it's completely up to you but um yeah oh, I love it yay hey guys so this is the last outfit and I'm just like so happy with how it's come out because just because um you go like all black doesn't mean you can just go minimal you can really play about with kind of the patterns and when I came across this um skirt last week on Nasty Gal I just absolutely loved it it's a size 4 and it fits really good and usually with Nasty Gal like skirts can be a pain like they can come up really big from nasty gal so yeah this is a four and it fits so good and it's just nothing but elastic like there's no adjustments or anything literally just slip it on and it is so comfortable and um but yeah it fits so good and look at the length as well i'm so so happy with it and then popping on this really comfortable knit again from nasty gal on top um yeah it really is just kind of like the perfect little outfit it's very comfy but then you look really cute you know with patterns and um for shoes again from nasty gal they got these really cool black cowboy boots um, and I just absolutely love them. Sometimes I feel like with petite girls we need to be quite careful with um, the length of boots and stuff like in case it makes our legs look shorter it's so weird it's just like an illusion thing however because these actually stop like at our shin area um, I actually feel like it kind of makes your legs look longer however with these like black cowboy boots I feel like I would totally like I wouldn't be I'm not I feel like I'm not gonna wear my black knee-high boots as much I feel like all the outfits I would wear with my knee-high boots I could wear with these um and yeah there's just so many boots on nasty gal honestly you will be spoiled for choice there's so many things on there um but yeah I really like this and this jumper is again it's so cozy I cannot get enough jumpers I'm so bad for buying <laughs> jumpers and things on this time of year but um yeah I just want to quickly show you this one because I feel like again it's a really nice kind of go-to everyday comfortable jumper Got a really nice cuff on the wrist area you get a nice kind of subtle um puff effect on the sleeves which I really like and then with the um, neck area, you guys know I hate a small neck, I like a nice kind of chunky thick big neck area when you when I have like a roll neck and as you can see it's a really good size like considering the jumper alone is actually quite thin it's not really that thick but I like those kind of jumpers because you can then like layer it up with all these thick coats and um yeah I just think it's a really nice size um neck area considering it's quite like a thin jumper if that makes any sense but yeah I love the whole kind of like I was like <laughs> I like the whole kind of puffy effect I'm putting it with a cute little skirt like this I just really like um, the two different kind of vibes colliding <laughs> okay guys so that's it i've tried everything on here okay guys i really hope you enjoyed this all black outfits video everything that i i think tried on this video was nasty girl um pretty little thing or video was Pretty Little Thing and Nasty Gal. A few little accessories that I used to kind of like make the outfits and um, will be down below. Everything will be down below in the description box if you like any of the items that I put on. Let me know your faves, you know, what kind of outfits are your kind of thing. And yeah, there we go. So I'll catch you guys next week. I hope you have the most magical weekend, just as magical as you guys are, of course. And um, like I said, if you are new here, thank you so much for clicking on this video. And it means the world that you've like even got this far. You've got to the end. I really hope you enjoy the outfits. Of course, I would love it if you hit that subscribe button. Enjoy the Annie Fam. Oh, and that notification button as well so you don't miss any of my uploads. So, yeah, like I said, I hope you have a great weekend. Catch you on Monday, and I love you lots. Bye!